Welcome back to Ty the Tasmanian Tiger. We're going to do another level. Now, which one should we do? Our Lar Pants on Fire. Beyond the Black Stump. I kind of feel like Beyond the Black Stump because I don't remember much about that. So, let's try that one. You go first. No, you go first. Well, I went first last time. Get in here. Can you take care of that troublesome Tasmanian Tiger? Well, that's just a thing, see? He's kind of, um, well, good. What? I cannot believe that a rat would outwit my two best lizards. He's too tough for us, boss. Uh, you know, uh, I was, uh, thinking, hey, uh, instead of trying to stop it, maybe we should, uh... You okay, boss? Come over here. Just come over here. I won't hurt you. Now, what's my name? Uh, Cash? No, that's my last name. What's my first name? Oh, oh, I know, I know. Let him answer. Uh, what? That's right. Can I take only boss around here? Can I no more be thinking? Now get out of my sight! If a seals, I surround myself with non-skull imbeciles. Maybe I can help. After all, who knows Tasmanian tigers better than me? Who indeed? <laughs> Bushfires at the bottom, snow at the top, and thunder eggs hidden everywhere in between. Welcome to the snowy mountains. Ty, this is so dreadful. It's happened again. The children were playing hide and seek when a bushfire broke out. They're trapped and I don't know what to do. Please, can you bring them back safe and sound? Sure thing, Sheila. Relax. It's weird that these opals are green in this level. Kind of interesting, too. Ah, up here you can actually... that you stop in your tracks. But oh well. I seem to remember this one actually has quite a few good interesting bits to it, so kinda of interesting. Where does that go? Well, well, hey, look at that. Oh, jeez. Well, cool. That's that's neat. Oh wow, this just reminded me of one of the levels in Tai 3. Wow. We definitely need to play that game. I haven't played that in so long that it might actually be almost like a new game to me. Son. 
Oh. Oh, look at that. That's actually kind of handy. I think I'll go back over there. And then we can go over this way. Oh, come on. So it looks like we've done a lot of this area. Yeah. Nice. I wonder if we can jump up there. It's probably an invisible wall. Oh darn. Yeah. Oh. Whoa, look at that. Oh wow. One of my goes over here. Golden cog. I can go for that. You did it. Thanks again, Ty. By the way, little Kiki found this in a log. I know you collect them, so it's all yours. Wicked! Who's the green one? They aren't all green, are they? I thought they, they could probably change colors. Ah, let's go and try this. There is that guy. That's already two. Pretty nice. I wonder if we can go up here. Oh, that's a shame. Oh well. So now we'll go up here, collect a good number of these opals, and try not to fall down. I'll switch my multi ring in case I accidentally throw my boomerang, then I won't accidentally, you know, like not have a boomerang to glide on. That'd be pretty bad. Already right, halfway through those. I seem to remember there's actually like a secret area off the map later on. Or maybe that is up in the corner there, I'm not sure. G'day Ty. Poor old Sheila's in a bit of a diz. It seems Booney has run off looking for thunder eggs. He heard you were collecting them. Well, wait a minute, that's my job. So it is. Can you go and grab the little tyke before he gets himself into trouble, Ty? No worries, Murray. Look at that. I think I heard a bilby somewhere, so... Ah. 
That would be where. Is this a secret spot or not? Let's see. Yeah, it's by itself. I'd say it's pretty secretive. God damn it. So we've gotten a lot of this area. I think we should go back and continue the other line of opals over here. Oh, yeah, this little place over here, too. Oh, it links up, I see. So close. Hey, let go! Now you listen here, Booney. What you did today was very irresponsible. You could have worried Sheila sick, let alone me. I'm sorry. So you should be. Now, I hear you've got something to give our good mate Ty, right? I found this. You can have it. Ripper! Oh, kids these days. Computers, internet, mobile phones that drives them out. And there's the last Bilby. G'day, Cobber. Those rotten trolls will be the end of me. They've taken to throwing rocks at the cable cars. It's a disgrace, that's what it is. Leave it to me, Ranger Ken. You're a dead set legend, mate. Gonna raster these up real quick. If that's the right term, you know, going back and forth like a raster, a raster display. I think that should be the right term. If not, it is now. I've decided it's the right term. I'm surprised there's no more stuff hidden around here. Kind of interesting. Kind of funny, actually. That's pretty far a zoom, I gotta admit. Gotta go down there. And I think, you can, yeah, you can get back up. Getting all these opals, that sure is a pain. Oh, I did it. Yes! I would hate to fall this far. That would pretty well suck.
I remember whatever happens there being a little bit difficult, so... Hmm. I'm just trying to remember what it was. Ah! <gasps> Ten! That's the last one. Sweet! That's what it is. Hey, too right. The department has sent me a snowball launcher to sort it out. But mate, I That's what it a is. clue how to operate the thing. Could you help me out? Well, hey. Showed those thrills a thing or two. You know what, mate? I want to make you an honorary ranger. I don't have a spare badge on me, but I do have this funny rock I found earlier. Bonza! Let's see, so though we have Clark 300 opals and cable car capers. Okay, so we can go back. And well, where where do I go? Oh, that kind of started me out in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> wow, that is that is definitely some. <laughs> that's one uh, snowball launcher for sure. Is that a standard issue snowball launcher? I wonder. Check that out. That is cool. Look at that. One last one and we should be up at the top. That's actually a pretty good amount. Okay. Now let's go down and see if we can get any opals on the way here. On the way down. Hey, there we go. I'll just run down there and get the rest of them, or yeah, I might as well get up here, because who knows, maybe there is a frill up there. Oh, I see. So you're not supposed to kill them on there, you're supposed to actually jump up here if you need. It's actually kind of cool. What a ripper of an effort. You knocked the stuffing out of those frills and made the cable car safe. I reckon you deserve this, Ty. It's a little something from the department to thank you for all your trouble. You beauty! Now just to go back to the entrance and turn in the opals to get the last thunder egg. Let's just look at that. I really wish that background image was higher resolution. It'd be really, I bet it'd be pretty cool. You know what? I bet they probably made a pretty high resolution one and then downscaled it for the game. It might be interesting to ask Chrome Studios to, uh, to like have that. Or actually, you know what? It looks like they've re released this game on Steam and they might have re they've been upgrading graphics and stuff like that, so there might actually be there might already be better versions in in the Steam edition. I'm not sure. It might be actually interesting to play that, because that game actually looks pretty fun. I mean, it's the same game, but oh well. I think I'd be open for some of the the changes. That is all. So that one's done. Rex marks the spot. Rex marks the spot will most likely be two episodes. Maybe, because there's a lot of fun stuff to look at in that one. Liar Liar Pants on Fire, that'll probably be one episode. Then I figure we can have the episode of the boss battle. I can't remember what the boss battle is. Hmm. 
Well, anyway, we're going to continue with this later on. And I hope you guys enjoy this video, and thank you very much for watching. See ya!